You're not gonna believe how easy this drill brush DIY works. Welcome back ViewCrew. We've got a new video for you today on ViewProof. Now this is a DIY hack. If you haven't seen our original Hurricane Spin Scrubber video, go ahead and check that out right here. Now for this hack guys, all you're gonna need is a dollar store close by you. Grab one of these brushes for literally a dollar. Then all you're gonna do is you're gonna cut it off right here, throw it into the drill, and just like that, you've got a homemade Hurricane Spin Scrubber. Now we're gonna put it to the test and see how well it really does up against something that's $30 and invent it for this per se. So let's put it to the scrubbing test. Okay guys, it was easy as that. We just sawed it in half. You can use whatever to cut it in half. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is, this is the part that gets a little interesting. See our drill right here? We're just gonna screw that in there as if it was any other drill accessory. We're gonna open that up a little bit. We're gonna throw it right in there. And we're gonna tighten it. We're gonna crank pretty well. Hopefully it doesn't crack. We got in there pretty tight. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it to the test. We've done the turbo scrubber on here before. If you guys haven't seen that video, make sure to click on the link to go check that out. But we're gonna see if this compares to the turbo scrubber and how practical this DIY really is. Now we're just gonna flip that drill on. Boom, there we go. And there you guys go. You can see how it's just scrubbing away. D, how is that scrubbing? Are you having to really push it or? No, just laying it up against it, really. It is heavy. That's one thing to keep in mind. That brush can get a little heavy as you're doing this. You guys can see it is coming off. Um, I'm actually surprised. All right, we're going to spray the lime away back on to the window. We're going to get down here in this corner where we got some little mold build up. Now, we tried this with the Hurricane Spinner, and it did pretty well. You didn't have to bend down to do this at all. As you can see, Den's kind of... Dee's kind of crouched over here in the shower so that he can get this spot, but let's give it a go. Now, it looks like it gets down in the corners pretty well. Doesn't look like there's an issue with that. There you go, you can kind of see it at work there in the corner. Dee, what are your impressions? Well, it worked. I think the, the higher rotation of the brush it worked really well. All right, as you guys can kind of see, it's dirty up on top and clean down below where he's been scrubbing in the window. And that's coming through. It's working really well, guys. And with my eyes, I can see it a lot better than you probably can, but it's working very well. Now, if you live out in the West, you've probably seen this quite a bit. It's all that calcium buildup on your shower head. You can see definitely how it's all clunked in there. Then you get the hard water spots on your actual hardware. And like I said, we've been letting this get pretty dirty so we can put this all to the test. So we're gonna see how the drill brush does on these. Okay, we're just gonna spray it down. And you guys can see that, it's just spinning right around there. Doesn't seem to be any issue. All right, there you guys have it. Almost looks brand spanking new as if it's new brush nickel. Super surprised with how easily it pulled it off. Okay, and here we go, guys. I don't know how well you guys can see this, but it is pulling a whole bunch off of there. This is super impressive for a dollar store brush and a drill that you already have. All right, after just a few seconds, look how clean that is with the drill brush. That is incredible, guys. That did such an awesome job, and there was so much buildup on there. Water was barely even coming out of those little holes. And, D, did you even have to push hard for that? No, not at all. <laughs> that is incredible, guys. Just a half effort with that drill brush, and it seemed to clean off that entire head. Okay, now we're just going to get the hose of this shower because that's something that's kind of awkward to clean at times so we're just going to spray a little on there we're going to see how well it does with the drill brush all right you just hold the bottom of that and guys it is getting down in those little grooves now i said this was awkward to clean 
because it's got those deep grooves in the cord, but look at that. All right, guys, the verdict's in. It did an awesome job, and once again, we're not scrubbing really hard because we just want to see what it can do at its most basic level. Down here by D's thumb, you can see all that buildup and gunk there. And we bring it up where we just were and it started to rip off a whole bunch of this. Okay, view crew, here's the verdict after all that testing we did on the drill homemade brush. Guys, this is a DIY, couldn't be simpler, couldn't be easier and couldn't be more affordable. Super cheap version and alternative to the Hurricane Scrub brush. Now, like we said, the Hurricane Scrub Brush did work for us. And if you haven't seen the video, you can check out that link. But if you don't feel like spending $30 or you just like to do things yourself and just DIY everything, you can't find a better solution than this. Find a brush at a dollar store, cut it off, shove it in here, cinch down, and you're ready to go. You saw how we did everything in here. We did from the shower head down to these appliances, all the way down to the floor and to the walls. And it was super easy. Now, the only disadvantage to this over the Hurricane brush is it is kind of heavy depending on how heavy your drill is. The other thing is you are gonna have to bend down in spots to get everything. Where the Hurricane brush has that 44 inch extension pole where you can just scrub along and not have to bend down. I mean, you're not gonna have to bend down a ton with this, but you are gonna have to get down on your knees per se so that you can scrub down things. Guys, if you like this DIY and you wanna see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe. Seriously, hit that subscribe button so we can bring you some more great content and check out some of our other videos. See ya. <laughs> Guys, we're not gonna be able to get this one done because apparently none of the batteries work. <laughs>